Welcome, everyone, to part 21 of our Pokemon Sapphire Randomizer Nuzlocke. I am Skull, and remember in the last part that I mentioned about Bad Omen? Well, as I said, I was going to, s to train up my Pokemon to level 30. However, alas, the Bad Omen came true. And I am about to show you exactly what happened. Uh, for those who missed the stream or haven't had a look, I recorded the clips and I am going to present them in this video right now. So, watch the unfortunate events unfold for yourself. <clears throat> I'll show you the p true power potential of me and my bird Pokémon. Now, I forgot to get rid of the Paralysis on Abraxas, the Dragonite, so we'll see how that goes. That's a Gyarados. And that's an Intimidate. Um, feel like switching into Circuit. And then just giving it a good Thundershock. That's not a good move. Oh dear. Well, lost circuit. Got the paral paralysis, which I did want, if I'm being honest. I can get bring out shadow. Oh dear. Well, right at the beginning of uh, the stream, and I already lost circuit. That's not good. Alright, well, confused, right? First of all, and then I will do a nightshade! <laughs> yeah, it doesn't affect me. Which was the whole point. Alright. No, that's not good. Oh! That's not good either. Um, right, let's disable that. We don't want you using bite. That'll do. That'll very much do. Alright, so we lost Circa right off the bat. Ouch! Very much. Ouch. Okay, good. Gyarados is down. We'll see if you have bug Pokemon. You have three. Wait, in. Uh, whoops. I meant to click Surf. No! Oh gosh, my eyes widened the moment I saw that. Oh no! Uh, replacing Absorb with Leaf Blade, you bet. I lost my tank! No! Okay, it's a, it, I'm definitely keeping it. Abraxas, because I have no idea what's coming now. I hate... HATE that wheezing! Damn it! How did I... No! <laughs> Oh, sorry, that could probably keep. I shook my head and my headphones went all over the place. Damn it. Quagsire? Alright, well, this is perfect for Jet. Damn it, I cannot believe. I cannot believe I lost Blue Aberdeen. I lost Blue Aberdeen. Damn it. Well, I guess Rika's coming onto the team, but damn. 
damn. Wish we'd never met. Same here, bro. Not only that, um, I, though we did lose both Blue Abadie and Circuit, so alas, they are dead. We also had the opportunity for three kinds of static encounters. But before I go over those, I have to show you the replacements. Might I introduce you to the team? And the replacements are Ra the Groudon and Rika the Walrein. I realized I spelled her name wrong, so I added an extra K. And there we go. So Rika is Blue Abadie's replacement, and Ra is Circuits. Everything else. This team is the same, Jet got a couple of extra levels, same as Shadow, but overall, there are still about 30 now, so that's good. Now, back to the uh, static encounters. Right, so in New Marvel Town, we actually had three static encounters. They consisted of the electrodes that would blow up as you would find the switches. Now, I'm going to show you all three of the static encounters and how... In the end, it wasn't that... Well, you'll see. Now I think it's when we're heading back that here's the problem. What was that? Hey, Razor! I cannot catch you because you are Razor. That's not fair. Oh, uh, because I can get these static encounters. The problem here is that I've caught Skarmory before. I already have Skarmory. That is not cool. That's not cool. Open up old wounds of the past. Oh, there it goes, Skarmory. Was that a trap inch? Was that a trap inch? Nice! I actually really like that. A body slam should not kill, right? Good. Good, good, good. Oh, that's... Oh, arena trap. Gotcha, gotcha. Great ball. Okay, so our stack tech encounter for this one will be a trap pinch. Which I don't mind. I might go for a flygon if things go. Trap pinch, the ant pit Pokemon. The trap pinch is a patient hunter. It digs an inescapable pit into a desert and waits for its prey to come tumbling down. This Pokemon can go a whole week. Can you imagine it? A whole week without access to any water. Well, in honor of what happened last episode, I'm gonna call you bad. Omen. Bad Omen. Oh, another static encounter! Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? I could have had a flag on first. No, you can't do that. You can't do that. No, 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 no. You can't do that. You give me a trap inch. Oh, this is dupes claws. I can't catch you. That's not fair. That is not fair. You really are a bad omen. That's not fair. That's not fair. So, as you can see, we only really got one static encounter, as we already had the Skarmory, 
we got the trap inch, but then the next one just so happened to be a fly gone. So uh, due to tubes claws in two of the f in the first and third case, I could not catch them, which was a bit of a shame. But that is as that's just how it is. So Jet currently has the experience share because I want to evolve him into a septile as soon as possible, make him a little bit bulkier, that kind of thing. Uh, Rika has the Mystic Water, Abraxas has the Quick Claw. Um, I don't think I have any other items that I can actually give my Pokemon right now. Yeah, I bought some repels and all that because of that. Oh, Soft Sand. That's perfect. I'll give you some Soft Sand raw. I did not see that. There we go. And that's about it. I don't think... Do, do we have anything for Death Arms? No, we don't. We'll see what we find on the way. So, with our team as it is, we shall head forward. We're not going to battle the gym in this part. The next one, for sure. For this part, we're going to get some other encounters and, and other things of the like. But right now, there we have to take care of something. And that is our dear trainer, May. Skull, where are you? Uh, where... Where are you? I was looking for you. How much stronger have you gotten? Let me check for you. Ready with your Pokemon? Of course you are. Go. This is the reason why I wanted to get to level 30 as well for the gym as well. But but that's for the next part. So let's go and fight May and let's hope that the bad omen doesn't remove another two mons from me. <laughs> okay. Right. Always gonna do what I gotta do, which is paralysis. Headbutt. Okay, you're weak to Rika. So. You're four times weak, so. It's all good. Aurora Beam! Look, level 29. See, I'm glad I trained up. You can also see the stream uh, in the description below as well. For anyone who hasn't seen it. It'll, unless you're seeing this episode uh, in the future. In which case the stream will most likely have gone by now. Steelix. Mm -hmm. Steelix, Steelix. Oh, so you... Is that, does that mean you evolved your... Um, Onyx. That's pretty interesting if that is to be the case. Okay, um... That's the thing. Uh, I'm weak but strong against Steelix as well. It's, it's, Steelix is a steel type and... Huh. Hard to say, hard to say. Um... Wait, wait, hang on. What does low kick do? Heavier foes. Oh, yes. Steelix is a heavy boy. Go on, death arms. Use your legs. Yeah, you definitely evolved Steelix. Uh, evolved Onyx into a Steelix, so congrats. Oh, look at that low kick. So congrats, mate. You evolved your Onyx. That's pretty cool, actually. I love that that was able to be carried over. Unless you got an Onyx now. No, you got Hitmonchan. 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 Huh. You know what? Um, Abraxas is good for that. Flying type, dragon type. No, I don't think Hitmonchan can do much, especially since the elemental punches are special in this game. So shouldn't be, shouldn't, quotation marks, be a problem. I'm going to Thunder Wave just in case. Just in case. But that's cool that she caught to keep, uh... see, there's the, uh... yeah, okay, I'm, um, hmm. 
So yeah, the Elemental Punchers have been returned to special, so they're good on Ali Kazam, not Hitmonchan. I don't like that, so I'm going to switch into Shadow. So you did have an Elemental Punch. If this was gen Generation 4 or onward, that would have been a serious problem. But I'm on top of this. With Confuse Ray, Paralyze, and Nightshade. Gotta be careful now that we've lost two more Mons. Nice. Hit yourself in your own confusion. And Nightshade, nice 31 damage. This is a good combo. Paralysis, Confusion, and... Oh, and Thunder Punch. So yeah, this... This Hitmonchan has the Elemental Punches, but can't use them very well. There we go. Jet level 33, three more levels. Shadow. There we go, we've defeated Mei. Haha. -ha. Haka. Acha. Acha. Skull, you're strong. I was worried that you might be struggling with your training. Oh no, I did an entire stream. Both. I split it in two, actually. One with just myself, and then uh, the second half was with a friend of mine who uh, wanted to jump into the call. But I, but I had an absolute, but I had absolutely nothing to worry about. Keep it up. And here, I have a present for you. HM2, which is fly. That's always nice. Fast travel. But we need the gym leader. See you, May. I think we only have one more encounter with her. Oh, there's the rain. See, like, for the majority of the stream, the rain completely kind of, like, left. Y you know what? Let's let's fight this ninja. The last two get a good a bit of experience. Hopefully. Not going to be bad. One Pokemon, and it's a two... Aww. Oh. Right. Um, yeah, that's fine. Jet can take care of the Totodile. Hopefully. Ah, you missed. Let the rain fall. I missed the rain, I'm not gonna lie. Love this animation. Leaf Blade. There we go. I admit defeat. Yeah, you better. I'm not gonna fight that ninja boy. I'm gonna first go into the Pokemon Center. There we go. Nice. Let uh, let me show you our death box. Yep. Here is Polydim Shade, Kaminari, Scar, Razor, Circuit, and Blue Abadie. They all died very young. But we must move forward. And we're still pretty good strong wise. I mean, I think this is a good team to work with right now. So, let's fight the final ninja. To hide in trees, use a forest. Yes, just don't make that forest, uh, that tree out of cardboard because it's very noticeable. You got two Pokemon. Codfish core. All right, Jet, take care of it. Don't worry about a little bubble beam. Leaf Blade, for sure. Very, very nice. And what's it? Mighty Yenna. That is a job for Death Arms. I do love that I have Death Arms in my team. Uh, my normal... Uh, Primate would have usually gotten a boost because it would have had the Defiant ability, but I don't believe that exists in this one. I think that's a hidden ability, which is later on. 
Generation 5 they introduced hidden abilities, I believe. Of course. Karate chop him! There we go. I bow to your superiority. Yes, bow! What are these berries? Oh my. Just gonna collect some of those. It's quite nice. Also, we've got we're gonna get a few uh, a few static encounters as well that are level thirty. Uh, in in uh, what do you call them? In the form of Kecleons. That we will. Do I need to go to the? Nah, it's fine. Um, let's go across here. Do you give me hidden power? Yeah. Thank you. Can I have it? Thank you, please. Uh, right. Uh, how about right again? Alright. I'm gonna go to the left. Ha! I get the hidden power. That could be useful. I forget who it is that tells us about what our hidden powers are in this game. But yeah, as you can see, there's the, um... Jim, but something unseeable is in the way. And there's one of the Devon Corporations, I think. Sniff. Um, you, uh, I smell singe. You were at the volcano or something. Yes, I was. Right, so this is Route 120. So yeah, I don't think we can get a counter in Fortry City. Uh, the stack encounters can, are considered our own. So yeah, we've got one encounter for this one route alone. However, there is a cave in Route 120, I believe, which is the um, scor is it? I think it's called the Scorch Slab. Though I'm not sure if that's only in Emerald or if that is actually in Sapphire and Ruby as well. But we got a trainer here. I'll fight you just to get a clear path. Why am I carrying this parcel? I'll tell you if you win. In my opinion, I think you're just carrying it just to be prepared. Either that or, you know, shade. There's an onyx. Hmm. Yep, death arms. Death arms will do. Let's see. Bind! Are onyx heavy? Hang on, karate chop it first. Rock throw. Your rocks mean nothing to death arms! Sweet. Alright. What's your next Pokemon? Smoochum. That's an ice type, isn't it? Yeah, you need to die. Okay, so it's not an ice type. Would it be a psychic type? I don't know. A parasol can't ward off Pokemon attacks. Okay, so, but you're using it for shade, right? I don't think strong sunlight is good for my Pokemon, so I should... Ah, see? I thought so. There's a Kecklon back here as well. So we have an encounter in the grass, and we also have an encounter in the Scorch Slab, if it's possible. So let's have a look. Okay, what's our encounter for Route 120? Uh, okay. That's a little awkward. I killed your child, uh, and now... <laughs> um, I'm alright with just killing it off. Oh, it lived. Alright, well, if it lived, that's great. I'm going to switch into Shadow, and then I'm going to try and catch you then. Uh, you never know what might happen. This Jinx might be helpful in the future. Emphasis on might. I'll throw a Great Ball. Okay. Well... Alright, Pokeball. I don't want to use too much resources, so... Yeah. Uh, 
Uh-huh. Okay, come on, just... Well, there's the Ice Punch, but it's more special now, so that might actually do a little bit more... Alright, I'll throw one more Great Ball. If not, uh, I am just gonna destroy this Jinx. Alright, I'm destroying this Jinx. I don't want to waste my resources. Nightshade. Goodbye, Jinx. You were a waste of an encounter. Okay. Alright, we have a trainer here. My Pokemon is strong. How about yours? I believe them to be, but our true test will be at the gym. Birdkeeper Robert. Bigglypuff. Oh, that's cute. Let's kill it. I already killed the Smoochum. I don't care. I don't care. Karate chop it in the face! Make it rude a day it ever existed. Maybe that's not the best thing to say since I have a Wigglytuff. Or Jigglypuff in my box. Your Pokemon were stronger. Your Pokemon was a baby. Alright. And Steven Stone, how are you doing? Mmm, Skull, hi. It's been a while. There's something here that you can't see, right? Now, if I were to use this device on the invisible obstacle, no, no, rather than describing it, I should just show you. That would be much more fun. Skull, are your Pokemon ready to battle? For the most part. Skull, show me your true power as a trainer. And this is a static encounter, so let's see what we get with this. An invisible Pokemon became completely visible. The starter Pokemon attacked. I appreciate the narration. What was that voice? Ooh, a Sneasel! I... It doesn't evolve. I would rather kill it. <laughs> but also because it can be quite strong. Okay. Huh. You know what, I'm going to Rika instead, because I have a bad feeling. That's a crit. Alright, give it a... S Let's see. I mean, Steelzers are quite moderately strong. Okay, it lived. I'm going to try and catch it then. Oh, the Great Ball was right there. It is a level 30, so if I... Ah. You know what? Sneasel can't evolve. It's not really worth it. I'm gonna just kill it. Before it kills me. See, it has Screech. I am not taking chances. There are other static encounters that are level 30. I can make do of that. I see, your battle style is intriguing. Your Pokemon have obviously grown sin oh, since I first met you in Dewford. I'd like you to have the Devon Scope. Who knows, there may be other concealed Pokemon. Oh, you bet. Sko, I enjoy seeing Pokemon and trainers who strive together. I think you're doing great. Thank you. Well, we'll see you anymore. Clear indication that you do have the T the HM Fly and you actually have the gym badge. Steven Stone has at the very minimum six badges. Well, maybe not the bare minimum, but still. I'm just gonna heal up and then I'm gonna try and get that static encounter near Scorch Slab. Da -da -da, da -da 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 -da. I always loved the music in uh, these Pokemon games. Okay, uh, hang on. Got a. There's a Kekly on here. Devon Scope. An invisible Pokemon became completely visible and it detect. That sounded like a. Uh, like a Metacham. 
And it was! As morbid as this sounds, this will be my replacement for Death Arms if something ever happened to her. I don't think it will, but you never know. Dragon Rage. Okay, good. That doesn't take half, so one more Dragon Rage should be enough. Nice. Oh, hang on. Okay, good. <laughs> That's right, hidden powers can be so unpredictable. Alright, great ball. Stay in there, Medicham. Sweet! Medicham, I say you're a man, so. Medi the me Medicham, the Meditate Pokemon, through the power of meditation, Medicham developed its sixth sense. It gained the ability to use psychokinetic powers. This Pokemon is known to meditate for a whole month without eating. Whoa! No wonder it's so thin. Honestly, I can not think of a good name, so I'm just gonna call you Hips. Yes, I know. Or, yeah, Hips. Hip shock. Why not? Hip shock. Hip shock. That's the best name I got for it. Alright. Got a nest ball. Which is all nice and all. Water's dyed deep blue. Oh, yep, the cave is there. Okay, good. So we have an encounter in the Scorch Slab. TM11, what is this? Wait, hang on, what is that TM? Sunny Day. Oh. We should have an encounter here, so which is it? Okay, there's no encounters in here. Okay, got it. Gotcha, gotcha. Okay, so Scorch Slab doesn't have an encounter whatsoever. Good to know. Alright, I'll get one more static encounter, which is here. Did that sound like a Metacham or Metatite to you? I see. Okay, I missed with Slam. Mm-hmm. Right, with the Kickleons. They are static characters, but they're most likely going to be the same one, aren't they? Or maybe not, but... What I do know is this. Two Kikleons turned into a Medicham, so... Very probable. Level 34. Which is nice. Okay, actually we'll leave, we'll have the final battle with these news reporters. I'm going to switch to Death Arms for Jet, because I don't... Hello, the news reporters, we will fight to the death once more. This will be the final battle before the end of this part. Smeargle and Abra. That's fine. Uh, Twister, because I can hit both of you, and Karate Chop the Smeargle. Yeah, Twister's becoming less efficient now. Thought so. You can't escape. Scratch the eyebrow. There we go. Nice. Very good. So we've defeated these guys three times in a row. Nope, not talking to you anymore. They cap out at level 30 for their monster. So nope. Alright, well that has been that. 
In the next part, we shall face the sixth gym leader in Fortree City. I hope you've enjoyed this part. I look forward to the next one. Just going to get rid of this Kekleon that runs away. Great. So until then, I am Skull. Hope you all have a wonderful day or night. And take care. Ciao!